So Chris and I have been working on a little project that's been taking up a lot of my time. Don't worry, this vlog is not going anywhere. Okay, good morning fam. Hope everybody is having a lovely Sunday so far. Guys, I really can't believe how quick February is going. Are you as shocked as I am or are you like, oh my god, winter, hurry the fuck up and be over. So you've heard us talking about this new vlog that I've been working on with Chris. I'm not in the vlog, I'm behind the camera in the vlog, but it's about interventional radiology. So the vlog follows Chris and his partner, Dr. John, around while they do interventional radiology procedures at their outpatient facility and some of the shenanigans uh, that go on at the office. It's a mix between entertainment and education. We're getting a fibroid clinic off the ground. If you don't know what fibroids are, you can check it out on our website. Oh, is this your first day? Well, <laughs> this is Dr. Marshall. <laughs> colleagues, colleagues, right there. He really look at his strong arms. He lifts, I don't know. Like, don't touch me again. Nobody really knows what interventional radiology is. Even some of their patients don't even realize they're real doctors. So that is the reason why we have started that vlog. So if you guys want to check it out, I've got their channel linked up here. If you like it, subscribe. I will warn you, there is a little bit of kind of blood, so if you have a weak stomach, just FYI, I'm warning you, don't say I didn't warn you. What is my role in their vlog? Well, my role is filmer, editor, director. Uh, I make and film these vlogs for Dr. Chris and Dr. John, so obviously these guys don't have time to be editing their own videos, so that is where I come in, I follow them around, I edit their videos, and I post them on the internet. This is the first time I'm, I've ever really gotten to see him, besides one or two times in Vancouver, do an actual procedure. When he comes home at the end of the day and he talks to me about things that he's done at work, now I can actually picture them and I know what those procedures are, which is really cool. And generally I've been able to like keep my wits about me in the OR, I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I get a little bit of a weak stomach if, and if I'm having a day, smells will set me off. Blood I don't mind so much, um, and actually I find the procedures really interesting. I wanna see what's going on. But I've been pretty good in the procedure room, surprisingly. I thought I'd be worse, but there, but there was this one time. She got so queasy in this room last time. We were doing a kyphoplasty. You're basically just hammering big needles into a spine, and she got a little bit, uh, a little bit green. Okay, so our filmer, Becky, almost lost it. She almost passed out just then. That was amazing. I'm sorry. It's okay, you did great. Okay, how are you doing? Not good. That was the first time I almost passed out, got weak, got sick. What was the worst part? Are you okay? Are you nauseous? She's nauseous. And then it kind of brought me back to um, one time I got like seven teeth removed and they put me under to take out my teeth. And as they were putting me under, they were, they were saying, Becky, are you okay? Are you okay? And the nurses were sitting, but they were floating around the room, sitting. And I remember just this feeling of just like going under. And that's what I was feeling like in there. It kind of brought me back to that moment. And then it was the tapping and the spine. It was just a lot. And it was hot in there. And I was sweating, face wearing mask. lead. And I had a face mask on. And I was like, is she going to throw up? Like, if she gets sick, I'm done. Becky has a phobia of vomiting, in case you're wondering. So anytime she sees someone else vomit, she gets, gets really anxious over it. Yeah, high five. That's the first time you've ever gotten sick like that. It is. It was a lot. It was a lot. So half my week is spent filming and editing for Dr. Chris and Dr. John. It's weird to call my husband Dr. Chris. Half my week is spent filming for them, and then the rest of my week is spent filming and editing our vlog, which obviously you guys are watching right now, which is not going anywhere. So don't unsubscribe, don't leave. We're gonna be having more content here, obviously. We've just been working really hard on this vlog, so I wanted to share that with you guys in case you wanted to see what we were doing, see that side of Chris's life. Um, and it's pretty interesting, and they're really entertaining. Chris and John together are hilarious great chemistry super funny so along with the vlog i've also been doing some marketing work for them some design work for them and i've been shooting some photos for them so we've been having a really good time um it's just been nice to break up my week and get out of the house and do work for them and then work from home as well where's your dr john working tiger you're a tiger you're a tiger do you want blue steel now you're now you're an innocent lamb I don't even know what that is. <laughs> what do you want from me I, I don't have the kind of experience with this that you have make sure you're uh, accentuating his arms Show the large caliber. You want know make sure you shush. <laughs> She's trying to make me a star, but I know that'll never happen. And it's not because of her, it's because of me. And this whole disaster. So the dynamic between Chris and John is hilarious. Like I legit do not stop laughing. What do you gotta learn, John? Instagram. You wanna you gotta learn Instagram. Learn it and crush it. You know what? Don't start with me. But I want to. I want to keep keep up with the times. I'm sorry. You're the one who wants to learn Instagram. 
What's your handle gonna be? You're gonna get handled in a second. Buddy. <laughs> You're gonna get handled. We work together. We work together. We work together. I'm the worst filmer because I'm literally standing behind the camera every time, just laughing so hard that I'm crying and I can't even hold the camera straight. John says he loves it when he looks over and you're like crying, wiping away tears and the camera's just doing this. If you ever notice that the camera is shaking, like right now, it's because Becky is behind the camera laughing and crying. Always, it's always a good day if I'm crying. There you have it, the channel is launched. I have it linked up here if you wanna check it out. It's also in the description box below. Head over, check it out, subscribe if you like the videos. We're doing vlogs here every Sunday tech videos every Friday, and then we're gonna be doing interventional radiology vlogs on their channel every second Wednesday. So stay tuned for that, I'm excited about it. I'm having a lot of fun, Chris is having a lot of fun. We're just generally, we're having a good time. Also guys, 50% of you guys who watch this video are not subscribed to our channel, so if you watch the vlog, if you watch us, if you like coming and hanging out with us on the internet, Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. People are asking me, Where, where's the bell back? You're saying to hit the bell, I don't see the bell. It's right next to where it says subscribe or subscribe, there's a bell. Hit that bell for notifications. Turn on the notifications, hit the bell. Get notified when we post new videos. Check out the channel. I will see you guys next week, Sunday. I don't know what the vlog will be about yet, but we'll see you on Sunday. My arm is so tired. Oh. Get it together, Nicholas. Come I'm on. so tired. Please watch our new video that I'm not in, but that I made. You're, you're a convict character, right? If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. subscribe. And hit the bell so you get notified when we post new videos. Something a little more invasive. <laughs> That's what I was watching her and she was like. <laughs> Becky, yeah. don't die. So this is great, like, medical imaging. Uh, Particle blades. <laughs> and then... <laughs> Half of my week is spent filming and editing for Dr. Are you serious? Why do I have that timer on? Is there something I was supposed to do today?